technical difficulty right there. We saw a little bit of German interview with our press officer, Margit. She's talking to some of the athletes. Um, we're going to move over here. There's a, they're getting ready for the medal ceremony right now. Look, they set it up so nicely. Look at this. Just come check this out. How cool. I don't know how this thing's spinning right here, but they do such a good job here in Altenburg. They have all these gifts to give out to all the winners. Um, super cool. And they're, they're probably putting on a good show because they're getting ready for Worlds uh, in a year from now. So we're going to come right over to here. So they're getting ready for medals. Um, athletes are still hanging out. So yeah, Austria is getting talked to right now, but Lappi is going to come over and chat with us. Um, they grabbed bronze. Are you tired? I know. Are you tired? They're yawning. I feel that too. I am so tired. Hello, everyone. How are we feeling? Don't worry. Don't worry. We don't. We won't stress you out. But if you if you feel inclined, I'll have you say something in Latvian at the end. So just think of that. Okay. Um, how are you guys feeling? Were you disappointed? Were you excited about this finish? Obviously, our runs could be better. Uh, we lost about 10 to the leaders. Uh, I think we could uh, fight them. Uh, unfortunately, not today. Uh, we'll see in other tracks. Uh, hopefully, we'll go better. Yeah, you guys have collected a good amount of medals, though, for relay this year. So that has to feel good. So we're just evening out the color of all the medals, right, that you're taking home. So we're heading into Winterberg. Are you guys, how do you feel about Winterberg? Yeah, of course. It's a... Uh... As everybody sees in uh, results and uh, overall in team uh, team relay, we are tied with Germany. So everybody knows that we can uh, uh, be fast and uh, uh, yeah, and fight for uh, for the gold in you know, overall. So I think uh, it's even more interesting uh, for the future race. So Winterberg is similar to here, where women and men both have to come down correct so that you'll be sliding from double start is that hard to do because sometimes women don't have to worry about it men always have to worry about it is it difficult to come down like for that run yeah uh, even before the start uh, just right before the start I, I said to our double guys that I'm a bit nervous uh, about the uh, curve nine here in Altenburg from the double start so yeah it, unfortunately it was uh, the uh, fortune wasn't on my side this time, but uh, hopefully I s still have somewhere to improve and uh, hopefully it will be better next time. It's almost like it's a little unfair that they just expect you to come throw down a run from the double start with no practice. That that would be, it's slower, but the pressure is totally off. I mean, they're just trying to make luge harder for you as if it's not hard enough. Uh, yeah, of course. Uh, I mean, uh, when I came in Finnish uh, and I saw the, the red uh, numbers, you know, it means that uh, we are losing at, at, at that time. So I, I was thinking, yeah, I had too much uh, problems in the track and uh, it's, that's the result. And uh, I'm, I'm always, it's, of course, it's funny. I'm, uh, uh, for me, the team relays are uh, going better than the single races and I was expecting to come with a like lead in the finish so when I saw the red uh, result uh, it was a bit disappointing for me for me team relay is so fun because you get to compete with each other so it's it's and sometimes less pressure because if you mess up sometimes your teammate can do so much better so on to you guys so would you like to say anything in Latvian to anyone watching at home Paldies mūsu skatītājiem, kas ir mērojuši ceļu no mūsu atbalstītājiem, kas mērojuši ceļu no Latvijas, un, jo viņi tur stāv mūsu atbalsts. Paldies viņiem. Yes, I saw this fan club. Who were they? Uh, my mom, my dad, my sister. Martin's mom. Your Martin's mom. My mom. How far was the drive to come here? About 16 hours. Yes. 16 hours? Yeah. They are far, far. I think we used to. We're driving all the time, so yeah. Yeah, me too. I drive 16 hours all the time. Well, that's so fun that your family. They looked great. The Latvia. Are they coming to Winterberg? I hope, but oh, they don't come because that's 19 hours or it's too far. Winterberg, there will be another uh, Latvian, uh, big Latvian uh, fan. So with a huge uh, flag, you will see it for, okay. for sure. Okay, I'll wait. I'll I'll check him out. Do, are they just a friend? They're just. He, I think he lives uh, somewhere near there. So yeah. Okay, very cool. Well, thank you guys so much. Congratulations on your bronze. I'll wait for your Latvian fan next week. I'm excited. Thank you. Bye, guys. The family drove 16 hours. Wow. Um, 
hopefully that car is a hybrid because that's that's far but like they said they're used to it uh that's that's pretty awesome but there was there was i don't know where they are right now but at latvia they had these white t-shirts that said l-a-t-v-i-a -A, and uh it was just cool so it's so fun to see all the fans and everybody show up for these races so everyone's hanging out no one's really left yet because you can join it's fine Uta, she's extraordinary here at the track. She does all the press. She's incredible. Your hair looks great today. Thank you. You, you too. Maybe? I will. It's a little scraggly. Where are you headed right now? Are you gonna? You're putting on the the awards and everything, or no? No, me not. You just get to hang out. <laughs> I'm just having uh, the overview. If everything uh, is working fine. Yeah. So I'll ask you one question, then I'll let you go. You have worlds here in a year. Do you have a lot of work to do before then? Of course we have. Um, although we have so much experience with World Cups and World Championships, um, there's always so much to do um, before World Championships because everything might be, not everything, but some things are different from time to time. So yeah, there's a lot of work to do. Amazing. Well, we're excited. Everybody come back here in a year. Altenburg, these nice jackets. You guys looked so great this weekend. I loved it. It looked oh, so awesome. Uh, the race was incredible. So we are going to start the awards. I, I loved all the, the goodies you had and all yeah. the things. So anyways, but oh, we do have a, oh, we never get to interview him. Yeah. I got to talk to him. Thank you, Uta. Hi, Kate. What a pleasure. No, no. Servus. Servus. Grüß Gott. Habideri. Habideri. I see you are very, very familiar to, to the German slang. You, you, <laughs> Austrian. you taught me one word. Everyone, this is Georg Hackel, but you, your nickname is Schorsch. Yeah. They say Schorsch. My friends, everybody says, name me Schorsch. Okay, so only friends can call you Schorsch. Everybody. Okay, everybody. <laughs> uh, Thank you for talking with us just for a second. Yeah, so he's thank you. it's a pleasure. He's one of the best all time in the sport. Slid for Germany. I don't know how many medals you've won, but I know that you've won a lot of them. I don't know. Uh, Good answer. Be serious, I, 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 I yeah. quit counting it. Yeah, that's when you know <laughs> you had a great career. And so he switched to the coaching side, was coaching for Germany, and then Austria, they uh, headhunted you, we say in America, a headhunter. Yes, exactly, they did. How did they convince you to hop over? Um, I, actually, they, they make me a good offer uh, for uh, for sure money, uh, but uh, more uh, free time in the summer and uh, and a good mood in the team. And but the, the the main reason for me was I was thinking about my life and uh, hmm, yeah, I was. I was, uh, for all that long years in the luge, I was in the same company and uh, this was a big challenge for me to go to another. And yeah. It's a, it was a massive deal when I heard that you became an Austrian coach. It was like, what's happening in luge world? <laughs> because his knowledge, we should, yeah. he will never tell us his knowledge because it's so, uh, it's exactly why everyone is winning on his team, which congratulations for Thank Team you. Austria. Thank you. Was that your doing? Did, did you put some secret sauce in the sleds? Oh, we, it's a, it's a, just uh, from the whole team, we uh, have a good, good uh, working together. And uh, for sure, my, uh, my experiences uh, uh, go into this uh, whole system, but yeah. it's uh, for all the team. Yeah. It's, it's really cool to see the knowledge spread out between other teams and to see other teams do well. So congratulations on the win today. You taught me one word in German like 10 years ago, ausgezeichnet. Yeah, yeah so diesen Tag war es ausgezeichnet für Österreich. It was, yeah. Did I say that? Okay. For Österreich, genau. Um, have, have you learned any Austrian slang? Is there Austrian slang? What? Uh, I'm... I'm surprised. I'm a, actually a Bavarian, and Bavarian is down in the south of Germany, very, very close to Austria. And I thought I have no problems with the Austrian <laughs> slang, but I, bah, it's really hard to understand them when, when they really talk to each other. Yeah. So it's very different. It's like it's not different, but uh, there are some words, some new. The the best word is schmee. Schme. Okay. Schme means fun to 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 uh, uh, talk anything funny. Yeah. Uh, it means, but also it means a, a trick. A trick. A, a trick. 
Okay. A shmei. It's also a trick, and uh, yeah, okay. it is. Shmei. Very cool. Yeah. Thank you for letting us in on the inside of Austria. Because I, when I hear them speak, I don't really understand German, but the little I do, I'm like, I don't understand anything. And the Italians are another story. You understand and very good German. You're, you're so nice. I'm doing my best to keep up with you and keep up with everyone else. Everybody does. So will you be with Austria for the next three till Milan Cortina? That's the project uh, until the next Olympic Games, yes. for sure. Yeah. And and then we'll see. Okay. I'm very happy for you and your decision and to make a decision for your life and your happiness. Yep. That must feel really good. Yeah, that, that it does. Yeah. Okay, <laughs> amazing. Uh, is there anything you want to say? Uh, do, do, do you have family that watches? Do you have any uh, family? Does everyone, I don't know. Or are they tired of Luge? They've seen so many of your races. No, my, 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 my girlfriend for sure is watching. Yeah. Hello, Connie. So, yeah, say something in <laughs> German to her. I love you. <laughs> that was the right thing to say. That was a good, that was very smart yeah. of you. Uh, thank you so much for joining us, Shorsh. Uh, congratulations to Austria today. And come join us on the show. We can, we can learn more German. I can teach you some American, some Los Angeles slang. Yeah. 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 What, Good deal. What, nice. Okay, great. Thank, Thank you, you so you. much. I mean, sure. See ya. Uh, okay, he's the legend of all legends. Um, he never wants to come talk to people because he's talked to enough people throughout his lifetime. But um, he is he is like, I can't give enough clout to who that man is. He has done so incredibly well. Um, we can see the men are lining up to do their um, anthems, do their words. So we're going to we're going to snuggle out of their way just a little bit. But uh, Georg Hackel, yeah, so he switched over to the Austrian team. And so we've seen a lot of speed come from the Austrians, which has been just cool and different to see uh, other teams do so well. So we're going to wrap up because I don't want to be uh, interrupting these anthems coming up because this is a big moment for the athletes. But uh, we've just wrapped up our whole weekend here in Altenburg. We're headed to Winterberg next week where we are going to follow up with more FIL Live, um, more shows for you guys. If you have any questions, ask the questions in the comment. Tell us where you're watching from. But that is it. Uh, my name is Kate Hansen, and what a wonderful day we had.